All right, let's test that theory that we came up with in the mod light activity that maybe some of the lead nitrate um, that uh, we had on the left hand side um, possibly made its way um, over onto the right hand side and some of the uh, potassium iodide that we added on the right maybe made its way over here all right so if we if some of the potassium iodide from the right made it all the way over here then if we add more of the lead solution we're going to make more yellow so we're, this is our our lead solution here uh, and we're going to add that to the left hand side get a drop going okay a couple drops there and it does look like Actually, I think that was there before. I don't think that we made anything there, or if we did, it's very, very faint. So the potassium iodide over here, it looks like not a lot of it got through or possibly all of it got used up here in the center. But what we'll do on the right-hand side is that we'll add some potassium iodide. And so if some of our lead from this side made its way over there without reacting, then, uh, then adding some of our potassium iodide here, our Ki, we'll add that to the right. And if we see a reaction, then we know some of the lead from the left. Uh, add a couple drops there. All right. So according to my results here, we didn't have any of the lead from the left left over here on the right because we added more potassium iodide we did not see a reaction. If we did see a reaction, then I would probably draw some of my lead particles on the right-hand side, knowing that some of them actually moved past there. All right, and then we also might change our arrows and things like that. All right, thanks for watching.